Battle 2's explored already? If you remember Battle Gear's great dimming in late 2019 and early 2020, then you will know that the famous red supergiant star status has been a hot topic in astronomy. Now new data from NASA's Hubble Space Telescope shows that its unexpected dimming was most likely caused by its surface mass ejection or SME blowing from its top in 2019, during which it lost a big part of its surface. Scientists don't expect Betelgeuse's weird behavior to result in a supernova explosion anytime soon, but they are perplexed about what's happening to the most famous star in the constellation of Orion. Our own star, the Sun, sometimes launches huge clouds of plasma into space called coronal mass ejections or CMEs. At Betelgeuse, it's at an incredible scale with its SME estimated to blast off 400 billion times as much mass. Scientists said they have never before seen a huge mass ejection of the surface of a star. We are left with something going on that we don't completely understand. It's a totally new phenomenon that they can observe directly and resolve surface details with Hubble. Betelgeuse continues doing some very unusual things right now. The interior is sort of bouncing. Betelgeuse is thought to be recovering from its massive burp from within in 2019, when a bubble of gas from deep inside the star produced enough power to blast off a section of its surface, which became a dust cloud over that, caused the star to appear dim as seen from Earth. Well, don't go looking for Betelgeuse in the night sky, because Betelgeuse isn't visible at the moment. It's in the daytime sky during August, so even if it went supernova now, we wouldn't see much of it. So should we worry about Betelgeuse supernova? Will it be dangerous for Earth? Well, the answer is no. Betelgeuse is about 750 times the radius of our Sun and 530 light years away, which is well beyond the 50 light years, danger zone for Earth. Means, if a nearby star does go supernova under 50 light years, then it will be dangerous for Earth. It can damage the ozone layer of our planet. But if we talk about the Betelgeuse, then relax, it is far beyond to cause any damage. And of course, Betelgeuse may have already gone supernova over 529 years ago, and its light just hasn't reached us yet. Well, we never know what's happening there. So don't worry about it, we are fully safe from it. And if you have any query about this, let me know in the comment section. And if you like this video, so feel free and subscribe Moneyverse for more updates of the universe. And one more thing, thank you so much for watching.